For the next seven days, I will be giving myself an ice facial first thing in the morning and reporting my findings. According to studies, if you do this facial every morning for 20 to 30 seconds, it can have the following benefits. It reduces inflammation, gives the skin an energy boost, reduces redness, swelling, and blemishes. Your face appears brighter, firm, and even toned. It's capable of shrinking your pores. It provides less oily skin. It's able to calm anxiety, and it is great for waking up energized. That was my first ice water facial. I got my face in there maybe for 15 seconds this time. In the morning, usually, I'm looking way more puffier than this. So it did reduce my puffiness. I definitely feel awake. I would love to do a comparison from day one to day seven. get easier yesterday i didn't get a chance to show you my face before i did the facial day three i'm gonna definitely show you my face before but this is my face after what i can say is my face feels tingly i feel awake it definitely takes down swelling so if you have somewhere to go really early and you're trying to do your makeup or you're trying to just not look swollen in general this will do it we are at 4 p.m but i'm not tired and i'm usually tired around 2 3 p.m let's see how day three goes it is officially that time of day again one thing i've been missing in day one and day two was showing you the before this is my face before i just woke up let's do this the ice is shocking but what makes this extra hard for me is not the ice it is the fact that i can't hold my breath for that long 20 to 30 seconds is a long time for me on top of that i also have a lot of nasal congestion when i wake up in the morning it just feels like i'm being suffocated i just blew out my nasal congestion i want to see if it makes a difference with me holding my breath Every time, right before I take my head out of this water, I feel like I'm about to drown, even if it's totally in my control. This should be way easier for swimmers. I feel like you're used to having your head below water. If you're not used to having your head below water, it is tricky. Clearing my nose really helped it. So that's one thing I'm gonna probably start doing is clearing my nose before. We are at 10.57 a.m. The ice facial seems like it's best in situations where you just need to wake up and look awake right away. On to day four. Today is day four. It is getting better. I'm able to hold my breath for longer, especially now that I am blowing my nose out before I do it. However, it doesn't stop the feeling of waking up in the morning and being like, I have to dump my face in ice cold water. We're gonna power through it. Cheers to day four. That was the easiest one yet. I wasn't panicking and I actually felt nice today. Day four is over. Moving on to day five. Day five of doing this ice facial. And I cannot tell you how over this I am. I'm so over it. Three, two, one. As the days go on, it's not feeling as cold anymore. The first day, it felt like I put my face in Antarctica. Today, it's like my body is getting used to it. It always sucks right before you do it, but right after, it feels so nice. My face is all tingly right now. I actually feel like I'm in a better mood than I was a few minutes ago when I did it. The act of putting my face in ice water, yes, it is annoying. But more than that, when you're just feeling lazy in the morning, you don't want to have to think about putting ice in the bowl and filling it up with water and putting your face in it. If someone could just dip your face in the ice water right when you wake up without you having to do those steps, it might be easier. But for now, I feel good. It just ups your spirit because you're refreshed. Today I learned. Day six. And I don't feel as bad as I did yesterday. I'm actually looking forward to this this time. Let's get this show on the road. Three, two, one. <sighs> oh, that feels so nice. Ooh, I have this huge pimple growing right here. 
and that felt so nice on it if you do have pimples it relieves the irritation i guess and probably the redness too i'll be curious to see if it gets any better today because of this ice facial one more day do you want to try the ice facial to me go ahead try it cat tries the ice facial for the first time made it to day seven and i cannot be more pleased oh and side note remember how yesterday i was saying that i wanted to see if this ice facial was gonna help this pimple that is just taking up all the real estate on my face as you can see it did not help with it it just helped with soothing it with that being said day seven let's do this I tried to hold my face down there as long as possible because I wanted the last day to be more epic. I don't know if I succeeded. We're gonna have to see with the timer. One thing I have to say about this is the first few days I had sinuses and a congested nose. And I realized for the last three days, I haven't had a congested nose. With that being said, let's look at some of the official benefits. It definitely helps with me waking up, reduces inflammation. Thanks to this pimple, I got to test out that theory and it definitely reduces inflammation. In terms of reducing reddening and blemishes, I would say it does. It definitely reduces swelling for me. Face appears bright, firm, and even toned. I've not noticed a stark difference, but I have noticed my face feels just better as if I'm doing something good for my skin. Definitely capable of shrinking pores. Definitely provides less oily skin. I can definitely see how it can calm anxiety. I remember on day five, I was stressed and irritated. I'm so over it. And right when I put my face in it and took my face back out, I felt 10 times better. Oh, I feel good. And because you're refreshed physically, you also feel slightly more refreshed mentally. I would definitely recommend it if you have the discipline. Even if you're not gonna do it every single day, just try it out because you need to feel that tingly feeling it gives you right after you take your face out. It is fantastic. If you try it out, let me know how it went for you in the comments. We have come to the end of this video. I hope that it was helpful. Thanks for watching. Yeah.